Our tale of the tape for this women's strawweight title fight. Both fighters 27. Joanna Ionchechek, five inches taller, three inch reach advantage. Bruce Buffer with the introductions. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the co-main event of the evening. This fight is five rounds for the undisputed UFC Women's Strawweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a striker holding an undefeated professional record, eight wins, no losses. She stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds. Fighting out of Ostend, Poland, presenting the challenger, Joanna Yeljajczak. And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner, a wrestler holding a professional record, 11 wins, two losses. She stands five feet one inch tall, weighing in at 115 pounds. Fighting out of Irvine, California, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed women's UFC strawweight champion of the world, Carla Cookie Monster Esparza. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Don Turnage. Ladies, you received your instruction for your step in the cage tonight. Three more things from okay, you must fight when they fight. Stop when they stop. Most importantly, intelligence in for all times. Touch gloves, back up, and good luck. Carla Esparza. Cookie Monster. Yes. Joanna Yi on J Check. It's a great nickname. It is indeed. Are you ready? Are you ready? Scheduled Let's for five. Five minute rounds. Here we go. Blue for Carla Esparza. Red trunks. For Joanna Yonjacek. And Carla fainting right away, fainting the level change, letting Johanna know it might be coming. Wants to see her reaction. I guess we're going with the Sparza and Teal like the San Jose Sharks, but nonetheless, she's going to push forward and look to put Joanna Yonjacek on her back. And Yonjacek has the longer reach and a very sharp jab. And there's there the is. single. Try to do it right off the punch of her opponent. So far, good takedown defense by Johanna. I and, like it. And she has shown really good Look ground and pound, too, Nice Joe. elbow. Nice elbow there. Oh. There. First exchange goes to yep. Johanna. Good statement made early. But Carla, as we've seen, is very relentless with her grappling. And we'll see how many of those Johanna can defend. First career five-round fight. For Yeon Jacek, as I mentioned, third for Carla Esparza. She went the distance with Beck Rawlings and Invicta, won in the third round to become the first strawweight champion against Rose. And there again, Namajunas. stepping over, stepping yep. over. Watch out. She's got to pull it out. She's almost out of it. She's pressing down the head, doing a good job. But note the right arm of Carla pulling on that left leg, excuse me, the right leg of Johanna. Johanna's got to stretch that leg out. Get out of there. Get out of there. She's almost down. She's down. She's down. Nicely done. Ah, very good. And that's the Carla Esparza that we got to know on the show. Absolutely. But Johanna trying to go out the back door. She's back up. Carla's got her neck. Johanna's out. Very nicely done, but still in the clinch. Let's see if Carla can drag her down again. Johanna's out. Knee to the bottom. Oh, Good nice right, right, right hand. hand. Good right hand on the break by Carla. Joe, you talked about those wins in the house. Ooh. Nice. Johanna has got to for establish now. that striking. She has not yet. She's thrown very few strikes standing up. If you talk about those three fights in the house as you did during the entrance, the Sparza's won nine straight. And down and again. again with the takedown. Second. Yeon Jacek. Trying to work her way back up to the feet where she is ultra effective. Almost back up again. So Carla is just on her like a bulldog. The same tenacity we saw in the Ultimate Fighter season 20. The question is, can Johanna get off some strikes? Can she get off 
Can she get, oh, there's a nice strike right there. I she staggered her. her. Yep. And she loves to push forward for the finish. Yeon Jacek, watch the hands. And Yana has an excellent jab. Real, nice elbow there from that position. Almost able to land the knee, swinging a miss with the left for Joanna Yeon Jacek. And Carla could still be stunned from that shot she got hit with earlier, Mike. Oh, beautiful job. Can't complete it, back to the feet. I'm seeing great takedown defense from Yeon Jacek. Yeah, and she has Probably the strength advantage here, much bigger. Well, she's a far Five, better six. striker. Oh, yeah, And absolutely. it's one of the reasons why Carla has to do this. She really can't stand with her. Not only that, she has a significant reach disadvantage, and she's just not as smooth with her strikes. She just took a big deep breath and got tagged. And Swing you see and how her punches are coming up short, but Hana is landing hers. Right in range now. Beautiful jab on the minute. J check. Oh man, looking for the big one. Esparza. Esparza is sitting duck, Mike. Yep. She's just standing right in front of her. Her hands are down, her chin is up, and she's tired. Carla has attempted, Joe, seven takedowns. This will be eight here in the first round. Yeon J check is stuffed all but one. Big storyline early. I like those elbows. Oh, beautiful knee by Yun Jacek. I like those elbows as she's defending the takedown, Mike. She's making Carla pay. 5-1. Carla Esparza, 5-6. Joanna Yun Jacek. Oh, beautiful right hand. Carla. Looks very vulnerable. And again with the right line. hand. Oh, she tagged her. And again. an elbow. And another. She's definitely got the Cookie Monster's attention. Carla is very, very vulnerable on her feet, Mike. As she's backing up, her hands are down, her chin is up. Rest. Rest. Very good. It's perfect. She's already gassed off. Now, now left. She she's gassed off. She doesn't have the energy. No, she she. Don't stop moving. If you move, you're gonna make her not throw. I move. Take the shot. Move. Make her make her miss a little bit more, man. But when you see that big overhand right, we talked about that. That's when you level change, man. Right? Run that shot through. There's a nice knee to the body by Carla and a right hand by Carla. That was the, the best strike of the fight for her. And there's a beautiful elbow by Yun Jacek in the clinch. And here you see Carla wincing. She knows it's coming. She lands that right hand. Joanna Yon Jacek in all the pre-fight interviews was very, very confident that she would leave tonight with the belt. She wasn't arrogant. You know, she didn't put down her opponent, but she's just so confident in this, her craft, that she feels like it's an inevitable a, that she will leave with the belt. There is a giant advantage for her in the stand-up. You're talking about someone who's a fairly novice with her striking versus a multiple-time world champion in Muay Thai. Six time. And she spent two years training under Ernesto Hoost. One of the greatest of all time and just is an amazing technician. Joe, former champion Jens Pulver said, Joanna is the pound for pound strongest striker with long hair in the UFC. There was a nice elbow there by Joanna. Yeah, Carla coming up very short. Oh, she's she's just in such danger. She's so vulnerable with her stand-up. She's stiff, and she looks like she doesn't exactly know what to do. She's thinking constantly, which wears you out. And then she immediately goes back to her wrestling, which is her strong suit. But when she's in the stand-up, she's got to constantly do calculations. She can't just go on instinct and training. Yon J check is stuffed eight. Of nine takedown defense. Or attempts, oh, pardon me. Nasty good. Oh, good combination. Oh, man. Nasty Big combination. combination. 
It is a terrifying position to be in for Carla. In the second round, unable to take her down or hold her down, and just getting battered. Oh, big elbow. She's Back nasty up. with those elbows. Defending the takedown and landing those elbows. It's very they always effective. say, Joe, they say punish him on the takedown attempt, right? She's doing it perfectly. And Carla is exhausted, and we're not even in the halfway point of this fight. She's a big, big trouble and a lot of time on the clock here in round two. And Young Jacek is just measuring her jab to the body. Of course, anything can happen inside the octagon, Joe. Oh, We've seen man. it. But it's not like Carla Esparza is, is a Roy Nelson who could change the course of this fight with one strike. No, she's, she's oh, very, very vulnerable. She's getting beat yeah. up. Yeon Jacek continues to push forward. Landing nearly 60% of her strikes. Two more. She can feel it. This is a real mismatch, Mike. A real mismatch on the feet. And it's starting to get ugly. And Carla is still game. She's still trying to take this fight to the ground. But Young Jacek's takedown defense is so far superior to Carla's striking. Joanna said in her 10-year Muay Thai career, she feels like she probably fought 70 to 80 times. What a difference in stand-up experience that is. Esparza wrestled in high school with the boys and then was an All-American wrestling collegiately. The elbows here, watch with the elbow from this takedown defense. She pushes off with the palm. And when she gets a little bit of space, she cracks that elbow in. Which means the head snapping back. Yep. There it is. The head right snapping back and it. the elbow's coming forward. Just constant punishment by Young Jacek. Esparza is in huge trouble. Desperation now with these takedown attempts. One takedown in 13 tries. Great takedown defense by Young Jacek. Nasty strikes. Oh, oh man. big right hand. Oh, man. This is a real mismatch, Mike, and no one thought it was going to be that. Well, Joanna Yeo Jacek did. She might finish it. She's got a minute still She's here. She's got a beautiful jab, Mike. I mean, it's just so clean, the technique. As far as it's oh, tough, God. but she's got rocked. And again. And again, they could stop Looking this to fight. Finish it right. It and is uh, all over. Joanna, Yeo Jacek is the new UFC Women's Strawweight Champion. Complete, total domination by Young Jacek. Just an amazing performance. The best performance of her UFC career. And it was in the most important fight of her career. Amazing. Striking was clearly superior. Takedown defense was really what led to that great striking. Let's take a look at our fight replay. Well, you can see early on that Johanna, a world-class, world-class Muay Thai champion, just, Carla didn't have an answer. She did not have an answer to the stand-up. And when the wrestling was ineffective, when Joanna was able to stuff those takedowns, she was just getting battered with every punch. She was losing energy. She was getting more frustrated. And then you see the beautiful combination that ends it. And Carla collapses right when the referee rescues her. Perfect timing by the referee, by the way. He did an amazing job. But Joanna, just what a spectacular championship winning performance by Yeon Jacek. Yeon Jacek, the new UFC strawweight champion. To make it official, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Don Turnage has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 17 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by TKO and new undisputed UFC strawweight champion of the world, Yoan.